Hello everyone, my name is Eric Creel, and welcome to the Creel Studios. So, thank you everyone so much patient to do my new episode of Why I Won't Rant On during this Halloween Relatives. So, if you don't know where it is, this is a section of Why I Won't Rant on a certain movie, anime, TV show, YouTuber, video games, songs, or what have you. So, here's my why I won't rant on a movie which is based on the show, The Banana Splits Show. And that is The Banana Splits Movie. So, originally, many people will thought, you think about The Banana Splits Movie is going to be a G-rated family friend, I mean, family friendly adventure, but it turns out to be a a horror movie that is rated R. Oh my goodness. What a weird thing that the Banana Splits movie is getting a horror movie and rated R. It should have been a family friendly movie and rated G or even PG for Pete's sake. So let's get into the story. So we have the main kid which is a humongous fan of the Banana Split show and then suddenly that he wants to come to Banana Split show and then suddenly we have the four characters. We have Bingo and the lion thing, the dog thing, and the elephant thing and who wants to do their own film in the live studio audience in the Banana Split show. And suddenly when the robot who wants to turn out to be the Robo Banaswitz gang who wants to kill innocent people. That's basically the plot for the entire movie. So I haven't seen the Banaswitz movie and I never will. So I will watch the Banaswitz show way better than a Banaswitz movie. So the story is completely rubbish. It tried to be like Five Nights at Freddy's but done wrong. And the visuals and special effects with a robot designs, including blood and gore effects, they're not good at all. And they were completely wrong. At least Saw, when Jigsaw wants to play the game to anybody and then kills Innocent, but in the right way. But in the Banana Splits movie, they did it in the wrong way. The characters are nothing like as the Banana Splits show. You know from Hanna-Barbera? Because... So yeah. Even though all the way back when, for it's nearly as three years ago, because Gian Frank's Productions, aka Trolls and Pixar Fanatic 2007, now hates the Banana Splits movie, and called that one of the worst movies of 2019. Well, but the worst movie of 2019, in my opinion, has to be Tim Burton's Dumbo live action remake. And so, yeah, that's basically it. So, and this is conclusion from my video of why I won't rant on the Banana Splits movie. So, warning, the Banana Splits movie has been rated R, so don't let your kids watch it. Please let your kids watch the Banana Splits show. So, I might consider rewatch the Banana Splits show for its 55th anniversary coming next year in 2023. So, thank you so much patient to do my new episodes in every video. So, tell me what do you think of my video? Let me know in the comments. And stay tuned for tomorrow is my redo movie review on Coco for its celebration for its last month's Hispanic Heritage Month. So, if you want to see more videos to my channel, click subscribe, click the bell button if you want to see more messages, notifications, whatever you want. And here's a brand new episode of why I won't rant on during this Halloween Relatives coming next weekend. So, Saturday, October the 15th, is my new episode of why I won't rant on Hocus Pocus 2 
and on Sunday, October 16th, is my video of why I won't rant on Little Muppet Monsters, and on Saturday, October 22nd, is my video of why I won't rant on Monster High, the live action movie, and on Sunday, October 23rd, is my video of why I won't rant on Rob Zombie's The Munsters, and on Saturday, October 29th, is my video of why I won't rant on Where the Dead Go to Die, and finally, Sunday, October the 30th, is the final video for my Halloween relatives of why I won't rant on Halloween 3, Season of the Witch. At least Halloween 2 for 1981 is way more underrated and better than Halloween 3, Season of the Witch. So, that's it everybody. Thank you so much for watching, and until next time, goodbye.